Okay, let's go here. I've been reading a lot lately about Japan and what's going on there, herbivore men, uh -huh. men shutting themselves up in a room and even dying alone in the room. I mean, they, the only way they were even found is because they stopped paying rent. <laughs> We actually have that already. They're called men going their own way. <laughs> and I don't mean that to insult them. I don't mean because I know a lot of you here have maybe found me through the MGTOW. But they kind of want to give up. They want to, okay, I don't want to work to get laid. I don't want to approach because it's gynocentric out there. So I'm going to shame you if you try to get laid. You can't get laid. No, don't do it. You know. So I think, look, they don't understand that the sex drive for men is very strong. I believe the sex drive of all the men in the world is greater than the nuclear bombs that we have. I mean, it's really strong. I'm sure you have slept with a girl that you wish you did not because you were just horny. You know, we all have that story. <laughs> like, oh, what have I done? <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> so we have to construct a solution that accounts for the fact that our sex drive is humming. And even when you get older, you're still going to want to sleep with a woman. So a, a ideology has to account for that. And unfortunately, these guys, they don't. They think that, oh, we just won't even try, and things will magically work itself out, but no. So I think, yeah, this is a growing thing here. Because approaching girls is hard, guys. It's hard. You know, I'm sure you remember the first time that you did it. You're really nervous and shaking and scared. It's tough. It's not a natural thing to go up to a girl that you don't know. It's just not. And to do it again and again, the girls, they treat you like dirt here. You know, they, it's like when you go up to her, she tries to be as rude as possible, and it does hurt. So you have to develop, what, a, a shield. You have to say, oh, fuck her, it's uh, her loss, and you have to do that. So I think the way I structure my own life is I say, what is the harder option? And I take the harder option because I'm probably going to learn something. I'm probably going to become a stronger man. So if you're taking the option that involves sitting down and not doing anything, you're probably not going to get a lot out of that.